uh, stream has started. I'm drooling, talking about cake. Baron is here with me. Excited about his pie later, I hope, because I have orders to give that. I, what? Yeah. You didn't see the Discord? I saw it, but I thought it was for you. Yeah, I was given ingredients to make another full pie of our own on the condition that I leave enough for you. Oh. So you're going to get a to-go container. Thank you. Uh, be advised that the graham cracker crust is homemade, and it's mainly just graham crackers ground up, soaked in butter, and then lined the pan. Mm -hmm. We were worried there would be too much butter, so once we put it in there, we took a paper towel and flattened, mm -hmm. and it pulled a lot of it out, and it looks wonderful. You know what I'd really like? Hmm. The recipe. <laughs> yeah, it's really fucking easy. Okay. Get a graham cracker crust, Keebler preferably. Um... Slice up whatever fruits you want to put in the bottom. Mm -hmm. Advisedly, I would prepare first the topping mm -hmm. so the fruit is not like just air. Uh, you take, we took sugar free strawberry jello mix, put it in the bowl, and then we folded sugar free Cool Whip into it until it kind of had like a goopy texture. And when it starts to like coagulate a bit, you plop that on top of the fruit lining the bottom of the pan. Oh. You can put the blueberries on top for like, Presentation. Presentation, but I put all the fruit on the bottom, as you saw. It's What's more of a... I want stuff pulling out. Yeah, it's more of a fruit parfait. Uh, something uh, we are going to try next time is that when we put the banana slices on the bottom, put a thin layer of coating on top to try and keep the bananas fresh. Mm -hmm. So there's not, like, air pockets in the middle. Huh. But it should be fine. I plan on eating it uh, before I go back to work. I mean, it's very low sugar. It's just the fruit. Yeah. I, as I've mentioned many times to everyone, I, I don't like things that are abundant in sugar. It's gritty and just makes me feel ill after eating it. There's a few gritty uh, textures I do like. Mm -hmm. uh, but I, when it's clearly not intended to be gritty and it's gritty, you're just like, mm, no. Yeah. No. Muffins. Oh, no, 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 no. Where they have the thick grains of sugar yes. on top. That's like someone swept up some broken glass. I'm like, scrape. No. no. Scrape that off. No, I don't. Mm -mm. And don't get me wrong. The rest of the muffins usually taste pretty good. Albeit a bit oily, but mm -hmm. I think that's a preservative issue. Most likely. <sighs> oh, wait, where's my phone? I, need I haven't to... made muffins in ages. What? We're in streaming? Hell yeah. I gotta watch this shit. I better turn the volume down. I don't know if we can get DMC'd for playing an ad audio during the stream that the ad is playing on, but I don't want to risk it. And given how stupid these algorithms are, yeah, it can probably happen. Is that Snoop Dogg doing a Jack in the Box commercial? Maybe I'm... Um... Snoop's Munchie Meal, Jack in the Box. Actually, that looked pretty good. Folks, glad you could join us today. We're starting a little early, mainly for our pal Cookie. Now, nah, yeah, just mainly because we actually can. But if Cookie's listening, we're glad to have you. We're um, we may run usual time tonight. We'll just kind of play it by ear. We may get done early. We might. You think I can be able to beat the game, like, in the next few hours? I'm pretty sure you can. Okay. Let's view the bonus content. I have high faith in you. But we have the Shadows of Rose. Oh, we do, don't we? Unless you want to do that. I wouldn't mind. Um, I've seen a bit of Shadows of Rose. It Mechanically, it might be fine, but... Is the story garbage? That's my impression of it, yes. Yeah, okay, we may skip it. We may do a few runs of Mercenaries to see what it's like. Yeah, Mercenaries could be fun. Yeah. If they're sad, we'll do Mercenaries. Not new game. New Stop game! trying to new draw game. this out. I've already been playing for like 10 hours. Yes. Yeah, three sessions, roughly. Two hours each. All right. You must escape. Honestly, I don't know why it bothers telling you that's your objective, because it, it doesn't really help guide you at all. Wow, the Duke's hitbox is huge. Look. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, actually, it's not that big. You're not even holding that really close. I just realized how pointy his nose is. Yes. How big his cheeks are. He's got, like, really high cheekbones. I'm sorry, does he look more terrifying than he did in the last playthrough? He looks less human. Mm -hmm. I mean... Yeah. Yeah. He's like, uh, you like what you see? You know, humans are 75% water and, uh, daddy's thirsty. <laughs> Clearly. He, um... He has a weird resemblance to an owl, doesn't he? The nose. Yeah, a little bit. Maybe he is. He's a mutated bird. He's a kajo that grew on its own. Hello. Okay, so this is the new floor we came to. When we escaped. But, you know, there are things we can do out here now. Have a look around out here. You might find... Up here? Either up here or down here. Well, I mean... One of them's gonna be the right way. No, neither of them will be. But, there's treasure. Got a long way to go. Oh, this will be the right way. Okay. But the, I forget if the, the side route might be that way as well. Back to the drawing room. We're having tea. Trumpets. Oh, here's where you came out. But, you do have stuff to pick up. Is this the way I came out? Yes. See the broken door? Oh, yeah, he just kind of went head first into it, didn't he? Yeah. Because he doesn't have a head. And then I called this up here. Yes. Now we go to the right. Yay! So much treasure. I, I glanced over and I saw like Chili Daddy versus, and I saw the Daddy V, and I was just like, "Wait, Diablo Four? <laughs> no, sorry. My brain's autocorrect is very iffy." Hello? Oh, there's water! That means I can survive the fall! The water is also highly likely to be either industrial waste or just... Well, actually, I would think any water in this area would probably be technically unsafe, except for the fish living in it. Hmm. But he cooked and ate the fish. What if they were infected? What if that's how they give you permanent stat bonuses? He knows how to cook the Kado to genetically alter you just enough to give you strength and power. Whoa! That. Okay. I want to think there is something else you can do. Maybe that's on the upper floor. Can you turn my flashlight on? No, no. he doesn't do that. We don't. We do not do that here. <laughs> Miranda thinks we're nothing but children. I mean, she's probably old as shit. Oh, she doesn't care for us? No. It does kind of sound like Nicolas Cage. I must destroy her. Doesn't he? Yes. Like a little bit like his, shit about his family drama. language pattern? Mm hmm. Tone inflection. Inflection? Yes. Oh, you gotta. Let me fix that. Oh, get a wind up. I probably saved a bullet or two by slashing. Perhaps. Reload. I wish there was like a backstab action. Is there? No. Have I been missing it this whole time? Oh no. If there was a backstab feature, I would certainly tell you. There is the RE4 remake. But the enemy has no idea you're there. Shoot 
juke, juke, juke. I knew that was gonna hit me. Well, don't forget, a blocked hit does way less damage to you than a one on the chin. Yeah, I mean, I blocked that one. Pretty sure, didn't I? Yes. Yeah. Ooh. I hear more of them. They there may are. be like through the wall or something. Oh man, that was definitely some shit I needed. Heisenberg has them mining raw materials for him here. I mean, they're not doing anything else. Yeah. Are you sure you want... Oh, yeah, you go ahead. The rifle will probably be useless in the next boss battle. Might be handy in the one after it. You don't see me. Oh. They know you're here. Ah, damn. Oh, that guy was trying to combo you. I see that. Does he know who I am? Yes, the guy who doesn't block. It's fair. It's fair. Inner voice baron. <laughs> I should do a whole episode where you just sit there quietly and I imitate what you would say. <laughs> um, I posited this as folks in Discord. If uh, we were ever in a video game situation, um, the super boss would probably be the versions of us that exist in everyone else's minds. This has always helped. They seem more you than you. It's like, it's not how this works, but okay. <laughs> Can I not kick the ladder down? I think the ladder's already down. Yeah, so... <gasps> I'm gonna... Oh, I should probably tear that down. Yes. It's never a bad idea to blow something up. <laughs> yeah, I'm guessing you saw the Discord message. No. Oh. I mean, I did, but I don't quite know what you're referencing. Comparing you to Heisenberg? Me? Yeah. I said... Oh! Fan of heavy metal and explosions. And the other is my best friend. I didn't know Heisenberg was your best friend. <laughs> I always knew it was second fiddle, I just didn't know who else was in the orchestra. Ah, it's not a bad phrase. That actually. was a, that little clattering of metal was a nice touch. I like it. A lot. Is it just like breaking the metal into smaller pieces? Yeah. Some of it manages to fall down. There's no railing here. Yeah. I'm about to shut this down. This is not OSHA compliant. You're welcome to send an agent. See how that goes. You just require them to put hard hats on all the guys. <laughs> I just need you to put hard hats on all of them. I don't care if you form them from your magnetic metal or something. They just need head protection. Now they're immune to headshots. Another one. Oh, cool. These guys have jetpacks. Mm -hmm. That's cool. I believe they're called Soldat Jet. By the way, there are two of them. What? What? They've got jetpacks! I know, I thought he would just like hit that wall or something. I didn't know he would turn. This is where you like, well, the wall turns. That. 
They're just gonna jump up here, aren't they? Indeed. Don't forget there's one behind you. I know, but I just realized I can jump down. Good, good. I just realized they can jump down. Oh, it's too bad they don't have friendly fire. This could be bad. Good. Ah! He was just outside the blast radius, wasn't he? Now you're about to tell me, yeah, this isn't even the boss fight! No, no, it's not. God damn it! Now there aren't a lot of jets in the game. You haven't tried cheesing them yet. What does dairy products have to do with any of this? They're lactose intolerant. Uh oh. They're also blocking the exit. You can't go up there anyway because of those blades. Oh, I have to beat them. Oh no. I think you could escape. But you have to shoot out some stuff to stop the fan blades. I mean, if you guys are going to do dumb shit like that... Going down! You know, I've never fought them fairly. Probably for the best! Oh wait, I have landmines. One down. Two down. Huh. You never think landmines would beat a jet. Now you know. And knowledge is power. Raw power. Unlimited power. I'm amazed I'm not like taking pricks of damage from like just sharp metal falling on top of me. Oh, and it looks like my jacket is healing. Good. It's made, from, it's made from mycelium. It's entirely organic. Yes, it's, uh, it's an organic set of clothing. It probably is. He probably doesn't even realize he made it. Alright, and get ammo. Yeah, that's probably what you should be using right now. I gotta hit the inside part. Yes. I thought the whole thing was a target. Oh no. So I think you could take these out and uh, climb them to escape them. Maybe. <laughs> so it just overheated? Yeah. Okay. Is there an item? Nope. Whenever you could try going up the ladder, just slice your head off. He just keeps climbing. How nice it makes the stairs. And that there was a gap down there. What a coincidence. Yeah. Yeah, you needed that. Mm -hmm. 
You guys Let's got any ready. goats? Just be ready. Hello, guys. Please remember, it takes a village to raise a child. It takes a village to dismember a child. Yes. Will it also take a village to reassemble that child? And hello, Digit. Hey, Digit. I believe Digit was in uh, the stream me and the wife did last night. Yes. Oh, what? Go ahead. I think you had these. Soldat enhancement. Soldat jet. Attach a jet pack and head stabilizers to a soldat. Greatly improves mobility. Experiments prove limited flight capabilities. No long distance flight, but now possible to navigate rugged terrain. You're doing the voice really well. Soldat enhancement. Soldat panzer. Oh, you're going to love this one. I'm not. Attached aluminum alloy shielding to a soldat to protect chest reactor and exposed flesh. Experimentation proves he's invincible against regular firearms. Armor doesn't hold up against strong blasts. Further development needed. Okay, so we have a weakness for the next boss. When God closes a toilet, he opens a... So, in the... Um, I'll give him the boot. Early stages of development for this game, there would have been a Heisenberg family. Like, more than one of them? An old man, two brothers, and maybe more. Like, the family-owned factory or something? Yes. Oh, you missed something. Not there. Oh. And I'll hide in here until it all blows over. You see Fanhead in here just watching television? <laughs> what if he was like Moreau's only friend? <laughs> That's why he wants to kill you so badly. Ugh. 30? Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna need it, aren't I? Ball mold. Yeah, I need a few of these. Yeah, Dust Boot. It's a Dust Boot? Dust Boot, yeah, it's a thing you do with computers. Can I blow this no. ball open? No, because it's got the rebar. Thing. Yeah. It's probably there to trick you. No, it's... Min so you could see into here. Yeah, when you get further ahead, you'll see there and think, Wait, do I have to backtrack? No, you don't. Challenge mode. Play as much of the games you can. Crouch. Goblin oh, mode engaged. Goblin... <laughs> Oh, could there be something hazardous ahead? I wouldn't recommend that. Oh, shit, that's the... What? Don't act like a chastity belt. <laughs> no, but you do need a cream for it. <laughs> Ooh. All mold. Yeah. Ah, that makes me uncomfortable thinking about that. In Dick Slice Castle? Yeah, in Dick Slice Castle. Okay, can I make... I would advise against crafting anything just yet. Okay. Yeah, the... You need something fast soon. Not necessarily powerful. Mr. Fanman, yes? Cut me up nice, ba -da -da -da. Check out where the fan went. Shit, that was close. <sighs> Why does this feel like the only time Ethan has ever panicked in this entire game? Every other time he's just like, oh yeah, you cut my hand off? Fuck you. Now he's just like, oh, I could have died. Well, he didn't say anything, but he was the baby part. That's a good. That's a good god. Yes, you are. Final boss is Rolf from Ed and Eddie. Hello, Ed boys. Ah, uh, hello, Cookie. I am Panzer Rolf. Yes. Stabby, stabby. Welcome, Cookie. Really? 
In what part of Ethan's mind does this even seem like a good idea? Ethan has a mind. Fair. Oh, do I not just jump down? No. Oh, I thought the whole point was to jump straight down. I'm like, oh, damn it, Ethan, you were so stupid. Don't worry, somehow I know I'll survive this. What's further down, though? You can't go that Death. Way. Death. A part of his mind that's filled with fungal mold. That'd be the equivalent of going, he's like, all right, Doc, how much of my brain has been taken over by the tumor? I got good news and bad news. Your brain's not taken over by the tumor. Oh, that's great. Your brain is the tumor. That's weird. Yeah, we're going to need you here for test. Of which we will charge you hundreds of thousands of dollars for. I always wonder that. If you're if a tumor forms in your brain and the material it forms into is a brain, is it possible for it to connect to the connective brain tissue as a separate entity or its own or just expand your brain? There'd be issues, I'm sure. To uh, the best of my knowledge, no tumor has ever formed of neurons. Soon, yet. She'll start her ceremony with your rub. A little tea party. If that happens, it's all over. For your kids. And for the whole village. Really? Awfully small-minded. Umbrella worry. went for the world. I'll stop it. I'll use Rose to kill Miranda. <laughs> Poor Papa. You're the only one who doesn't see your kid's power. My kid's not a freaking mutant like you, you monster. I'd like to see you try. You're, uh... You might want to take that a step back, Ethan. Another step. One more. Ah! There it is. I tell you, I grew up watching Looney Tunes. Always wanted to try that trick. Kind of impressed it worked. I mean, even Moreau didn't fall for that one. That's a trick. Oh, yeah. Okay, good, good. What's... What's in the box? Emo. Okay, so he's lifting around what has got to be, like, 50 to 80 pound lead blocks. But he's not thinking, like, wow, this is normal human strength. I'm carrying five of these. Good news, we'll test you free of charge. Bad news, last few test subjects didn't fare so well. See, this is why when you realize you're a freak of nature, you get examined by a scientist, not a medical doctor. A scientist will pay you. Yes. For new information. Medical doctor will charge you for new information. Wait. Wait. For those at home who don't know, this particular model of grenade launcher is one of three of my real world favorite firearms. The other two being the C96 Broomhauser, also known as the Red 9 variant, which presented in RE4, and the AK-47. Don't ask me why, I just love those guns. And they also have noticeable wooden handles on them. Hmm. I wonder if that's a... I like guns made of wood. Now... There's more? I'm... I may try to find out if there's any game that features all three weapons at once. Oh, that'd be pretty awesome. I'd be worried to be a shit game, though. It'll summon the elevator up here. And hey, the Duke's on board. I'm on board, Ethan. I'm here to help. Are you hungry? You look a bit peckish. Yes. I love the... By the way, there's Duke. more treasure off the left. Oh, well, I didn't know if like going past here would trigger... A... Oh no, this is optional. I mean down there? Behind you. Like, drop down. Yes. It's not... It's one way at the moment, but you loop around. There's a chemical which is red more and paint just lit it on fire. Mind, Sharona. 
I have a feeling I'm going to need those. Oh, they will help. He hit the chain, falls off into the abyss. Look around before you drop. No! <laughs> Alright. I'll go back. I'll go back. I'm just waiting for once, like, you go across one of those zip lines, and, like, someone's on the other side with a pair of scissors, just like, really? You wonder why we highlighted everything in yellow? To build trust. Heisenberg is standing there holding a, his finger up, levitating a machete. Really, Ethan? <laughs> no, a handsaw just slowly going across the road. <laughs> Whee! I'm gonna go again! It's the principle of the thing. That's fair. It's, you, you were not. Oh, wait, wait, wait! There was something. What? Behind you. Oh, okay. All right, all right. I'll give you. I'll get. Well, I better look around. There may be something else up here. Levitating the rope, in a steel cable. Wow! He's like, no. <laughs> like Heisenberg has had every opportunity, even when you made a man, to just outright kill you. Yeah. Oh, uh, I'll levitate that gun you're holding to your head and shoot you instead of kicking you down to the labyrinth and hoping that I'm able to stop you when everyone else couldn't. And you've slowly been making your way through the lieutenant hit list. This game's story um, reeks of um, rewrites. Uh, midway rewrites, I mean. Should I buy some explosives? You want to sell some junk first? Maybe. Go ahead. Put your hand in the Duke's pockets. See if there's a treasure for you in there. Holy Crystal Skull? Spoiler, Heisenberg had stock in Capcom. If he killed you that quickly, there wouldn't be a game to profit from. This should be enough. This should be enough. Save that cylinder, of course. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Securing goods is more important than anything. Anything, my friend. Could I? You think I need to? I think I do. I mean, I need to, but it certainly would help. I saw you eyeing that one. I saw you eyeing my high explosives in this dangerous village you're in. Mm -hmm. uh, ooh. Ooh. I can make the Magnum even more powerful. Pretty limited oh. ammo, but I'm... What? What a decision. Oh, because there's another pistol, right? Or is this it? No, this is the last one. The last one, yes. Right, right. Is this the only Magnum? It is. Well, the only Magnum in the base game. Mm. You unlock. You can unlock the stake. You're iffy on telling me something? No, I'm iffy on thinking whether you should upgrade the Magnum or the regular pistol. Oh, this has become my boss killer weapon, and the bosses seem to be the hardest fights. Good point. These hands are more dexterous than one might think. I give a mean handy. Good day don't, then. Don't 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 shake your tits at me. I don't need that right now. Later, dude. Later. After the after this is all. Call me. Call me. The Duke's a sweetie. And the fact that his best friends is the arms dealer from the other Resident Evil 4 game. Yes. I'm just like. I love it. It's like, ha ha, something an old friend of mine used to say. I was like, oh, they're buddies! Or as my wife would say, oh my god, they were roommates. Mm -hmm. Do you know that particular joke? No. Um, when uh, literature professors and researchers are, like, looking into, like, the history of authors and old research, uh, old authors, uh, there might be letters or diaries that are just like, oh yeah, um, it is heavily implied that this person and that person lived together and they were a gay couple. Oh. But historians at the time and leading up were like, oh, no, 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 no. Gay didn't exist back then. They were just roommates. They just lived together because it was convenient. It's like, no, they they be fucking. I think the meme these days is, and they were just very good friends. Yeah. I love that. It's like, oh, my God, they were roommates. Yeah, you can't get in here yet. Oh, I gotta go downstairs. You got the key mold. 
And the ball mold. I better do the ball mold first, because yes. I don't want to forget. Was it it's B4? B4. Oh, basement four. That's right, it goes down. Right, the factory doesn't have a second floor. It's all underground. That way, Heisenberg can do what he needs to away from prying eyes. The crows can't get down here. Wait, does Miranda not know he has a cyborg army? She might, but Miranda is also kind of a dumbass. No, what we need to do is form a cult. And he's like, why? I have hundreds of thousands of these cyborg soldiers ready to go. A little more work, and they wouldn't have any issues. Andrew and Sarah this being cousins. Yeah, in uh, Sailor Moon, uh, Neptune and Uranus are lovers originally, but in like the English dub, they're like, oh my god, they're cousins. And it's like, yeah, but this animation still shows them like heavily flirting with each other, so this is kind of weird. Ah, so the English localization was more... <laughs> Cute banjo. Was it this way? It's dark. Thank you, Ethan! I forget. Yes. Okay. I didn't know if it was like, was there another door? There is another door, but it leads to a room you've already been to. Just one room. So, because you had to reroute power, the lights are off down here. Oh, I was about to say, it looked a little creepier than usual. Yeah, Which because, as Ethan said, new... it's dark. It's new encounters. Yes. Oh. Sorry, I trust my shotgun. Every single video game. I trust my shotgun. Oh, that was a dumb move, pal. That was funny. You Don't made... you know you got to kiss the barrel? <laughs> yeah, you made him look like a dumbass. Just like inches from my face, like, really? You could lean in a little bit. <laughs> Jazz drill. And here we are. Am I going the wrong way? You are. Thank you, Baron. You know, there's still power here. Clearly not the direction the programmers wanted you to go. I was giving you time. So, um, I'm kind of excited for Remnant 2. Because I didn't realize... Gearbox is making Remnant 2. What the hell is Remnant 2? Remnant from the Ashes. The sequel. Oh. You never played it. I have not. No. I know you haven't. I don't quite remember it. Wait, there was an item back there, I think. Yeah. I was, I, a lot of that I was saying for like... Oh, cookies. no. It wasn't. Because Cookies played it. Is this the right way? Could be. I should stop and ask for directions. You've also got a map. Bullshit. Stop hissing at me. Yeah, that helped. Hmm, where's the mold room? Hmm. Not labeled. Do you know where it's at, Baron? I do. Okay. Is it through here? Is it? Or is that the way I came? Grab a Snickers, everybody. You know what? That was the way I came. No, this is the wrong way, but it could be the right way, because I remember one of these rooms looped back to it. Yeah? Yeah, see, we're getting some... Uh... Huh. Ah, no, here's the door. It's a very Dory door. Finding Dory. Oh, no, I recognize it. Son of a bitch! All right, all right. Plus this, man, my favorite elements are helium, nitrogen, tantalum, and iodine. Now, on the periodic table, that spells something. Anyway, how's it going, my sexy friends? H-N-T-I? Ah, hentai. <laughs> my favorite element. Yes. Alright, no, wait, yes. Yes. So, right now I'm having fun watching Balefear run around like a rat in a maze. I was born in the year of the rat, thank you. So was I. You know that doesn't come up as a lot. You see memes where it's just like, uh-oh, I ran over somebody, it's okay, I'm a Scorpio. I'm just like, yeah, I'm a rat. 
<laughs> like, it doesn't, it doesn't have the same feel to it. They either think that you're a rat bastard, or they think you're into some weird furry shit. Okay, this is looking different than the other rooms I went into. No, it isn't. I was here a minute ago. <laughs> Alright, Baron, guide me. I don't think they want to see 15 more minutes of this. Maybe they do. Yeah, you know, I distinctly remember... No. Wait. Alright, from here, look where you can possibly go. Yeah, I can go this way. But that's where you came from. Is it? Okay. Look where I can possibly go. Mm -hmm. Downstairs. Oh, wait. Is that the room right there? I've been so fucking blind. Try going downstairs in this room. Just give me a minute to find the stairs. I think they're over here. Yes. Ah. If I find a new enemy, that means I'm right. Oh, second verse, same as the first. Only two shots this time, good job. <laughs> Held it next to me. Dude, check out my new drill. Oh, Fustus, that was a good science joke. You're not an idiot. I'm an idiot. Woohoo, I found it. Not only needed slight guidance. Hey, look where you can go. Mmm, <laughs> ball mold. Delicious. So, I thought it would be neat if enemies would attack during one of these, but they don't. Oh, he sweats if you stand close to it. Yeah. Here's your ball. We heard you lost one. Isn't that, like, another way of saying train? Or is that iron rooster? I thought horse... Did refer to a train. Well, Iron Horse is a motorcycle, I believe. Oh. I think trains were Iron Roosters because of the whistle. Oh. A big metal cock on the track. Heisenberg's key. See, it's modeled like a horse. Because I like horses. They're awesome animals, Ethan. Have you ever seen a horse? Because like horses, I too am a man. <laughs> Heisenberg, I think you should stick with engineering. Leave biology out of it. <laughs> completely. Except what little you need to make your cyborgs. You know, stay out of zoology. Cyberfish. So... You make cyborgs of all the dead bosses you fight later. <laughs> You'll want to uh, look around the staircases near here, as I believe you can not back out the way you came, though. Oh, good, good, good. Um... You can use Heisenberg's key on an optional room not far from here. Okay. I just forgot which staircase it's up. To the left. Okay. Heisenberg's quarters. Awesome! Then we can play Heisenberg's arcade machine. I was hoping you'd make a joke about money. Look in the window. You want to take advantage of anything? Gentlemen! And they can't come through here. Can oh, shit, there's more. They can't come through there. Because they can't unlock the door. They can crowd the door, though, waiting for you to open it. Can I throw a pipe bomb in there? No. Just reach through and drop it? I tried. It doesn't work. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, that's one. Right, you thin their numbers a bit. Man, his arm is swinging way too much for me to get a clear shot. You pick up the herb for the door. Wait, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> it's locked, Ethan.
Nicely done. Okay, I wasn't sure if he was dead or not. Usually they drop their weapon completely. Yeah. Catching up with shit. Oh, we picked up a shaft. And we combine it in the treasures. Those are key items. Right. Oh, you make his hammer. Yes. Which is not a weapon for you. <laughs> Try using that against Heisenberg. He's like, really, Ethan? Well, you uh, oh. never read comics, have you, Ethan? It's too heavy to use. Is Heisenberg just really, really strong, or is he using his powers to make it lighter? He's probably using his powers, though he may be stronger than a normal person. Is that everything? Oh. In this room, yes. yes. Now, there's another grayed out room. The operating room. Yes. Yeah. The fuck do I get there? No, wait, it's not this way. Mm. Is that another Heisenberg key? It might be. Oh, oh I'm trying to get my crypto coins. I've come to accept that name. Oh, no, it's that one. Yes. Oh, because I redirected power, right? Yes. The shotgun has served me well. Let's have a careful look around. My apologies, you may end up with more lock picks than locks. How many of you guys are going to wake up? Who's running this? There's so much to do. How is Heisenberg doing all of it? He's... driven guy. Four shots, but I'll take it. So I expected one of these to wake up. He just came through the door. Subversion of expectations. The Joker would be proud. Wasn't that his thing? Never give them what they expect? Yes. Oh, this is a good Medical one. Medical log. Revitalization surgery. This is my 18th attempt. The subject is Oscar the Stable Boy. 20 years old. He fell down the well while drunk. Body is in good condition. Chest incision complete. Now to remove the heart and vital organs and implant the control device. Excellent. Cadeau has begun adhering to the nervous system. Quick. It's progressing even faster than before. It seems upping the ratio of meta-albumin in the artificial blood was the right choice. Now to pass a current through the brain stem using 6,600 volts. Come on. It has to work this time. Yes. Yes! Ha 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 ha! Wonderful! My creation! At last! I'll get that bitch yet. Magnum upgrade. What does this do? Raises damage. Really? Yes. 
but takes up the same amount of space in inventory. Yeah, it's not like earlier games. No. All right. Doesn't look much longer. I think you just took the old barrel off and put this one on. Yes. Uh, probably via that release release the slide. I don't know how he did it. 2300 plus 200, so 10% more power, roughly. Yes. Is that everything down here? Yes. Okay. I wonder if one of the reasons that Miranda considered Heisenberg to be more of a success is he was more industrious. He not just actually making... tried to be better. Well, he's doing more experiments than most of the others. After Lady D made her fly girls, she was practically done experimenting. Did Lady D even make them? She had a hand in it, I'm sure. Um, I don't know if Donna did any real work with the Cado outside of the plants. And Moreau tried. Looks like he did more experience on himself than anything. I think much of that just progressed naturally with him, and he had that little clinic where he'd occasionally cut open one of the lichens. Alright. Now we need to make our way back to where the Duke is. Okay. Hello, Ponzer. Seriously? Yes. Landmines do more damage. Back up a little. Wait for the explosion. And, and then, then the weak point one? should be available. Now the weak point should be vulnerable. I think. Yes, it is exposed. Oh, he's got like... Oh, wait, this might not be the Panzer. Sorry. Well, I mean, I blew parts off of him. He's got, like, more than one drill thing. Mm -hmm. Ah! I tried to run. So he knows when I'm aiming at him. You can't. You can knock out the run, dip. You can outrun it, but you've got to be faster. And you've already got upgrades to your blocking power, so honestly, most of the time you're better off blocking. Though in horror games, it feels more instinctive to dodge. Maybe he hasn't just flipped the table yet. Indeed, a panzer. What was the most important part of that sentence I said? A panzer. Very good. Here's pansy. That doesn't. You really like that way, don't you? You're right. It was this way. Was it? I... Here we go again, folks! No. Not 
everyone can memorize a map like you do. I know. Without me opening the map, could you tell me which way to go properly? Yeah, you could. Huh, down. That doesn't seem right. Oh, it is. This is the right way. Another panzer. And then he'll be vulnerable after that. Oh, really? He blocked it? I guess so. How far is he willing to chase me? Get him somewhere I can juke him. I've never tried running this far in this direction. He might have leashed. Great, now he can be around any corner. Not a smart move on his part. Is he leash right there? I don't. I thought he came through before. He did. You gotta know when to hold them and when to juke them. Oh, I'm so mad. I think I hear him turning around. I mean, if he's going to keep doing the yep. same thing. Yeah, that's that's good. I'm doing the Baron method. It's cheap and easy, but mostly cheap. Yeah, I can't get a second to go off the top. Is someone taught him how to open a door? The door shuts and he spawns out. <laughs> no! You teach <laughs> me! It seems I was the Jew kid! You didn't give him enough time to go back. <laughs> wow. Let's <laughs> open the door! He had already turned around! He's like, oh, we'll play this fucking game. <laughs> wow. The fucking shoot me! You got impatient. No, I got cocky. There's a difference. Little bastard. Do I... Wait, what? Labyrinth? Closer? Yes. You know, the little whirly ball thing. Ugh. I have to read through a bunch of shit now. It's dark. Yeah, no shit. And you're alone in it. Is 
So what have we learned? Nothing. Uh, okay, he got it that time. Stick to left. Down here. Yes. Okay. Thank you, Baron. <laughs> Panzer time. No, not yet. Not yet. That, uh, that death, it, uh, it got you, didn't it? I'm a little mad, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> On one hand, I'm proud of the enemy? Ah, <laughs> uh, I was about to say, through this door? Yeah, through the door. Nothing's going to attack you. Here's a few molds. Uh, <laughs> Then we take both of the upstairs routes to get treasure. Up there? Yes, and up these stairs. Other stairs, too. I just vanished. How do you like my 3D printer, even? I mean, yeah, it kind of is. Yes. There's an asshole through the door. I was hoping to get another shot of this gun is not as fast as I thought it was. Wow, really? One did seem to have a good hotel. We had a visor on, did that matter? Maybe. Medical log. Revitalization surgery. This is I didn't want it to think I didn't get that report. Well, fair enough. Yay, I might use that. Eventually, yes. No, sooner than you think. Stairs. Down here? Yes. Oh, can I lure him down there? No. Oh, he'll tether. Yes. Right. Get the scrap on the table. Yeah, there it is. And head up the other staircase. And you want to take some shots at the uh, enemies in the room? Yeah, I really do. I feel like I've earned it. Ethan has one of those uh, little gra little grab claw things. Oh, good dodge. That one grazed you, but you 
shat some gold for me, so we'll call it a wash. Sure. Yeah, I, I remember the moving parts are not place to be. And it's this way? Yeah, because I looped him. And there's going to be one up there. Along with that treasure. Let me just knock that down now. Are these timed? No. Good. So he just covered them in like a lot more plates of metal and was like, huh, that fixed the problem. Yes. And he taught them to cover their chest plate. So, are they intelligent? They have some intelligence, of course. I wonder how well another landmine will do against him. Not that well. Neither did the pipe bomb earlier. Gotta hit the weak point. Do I have the rifle ready? When he does that break in. I've never tried aiming the rifle without the scope. And... Hey, when the enemy holds still. Okay, that was a much better run than last time. Oh, the first one you took out pretty handily. Oh, crypto coins. Oh, here's the... I wonder if you head to one of the other floors of the elevator, if you can call, the, call it there and skip this fight. Or do you want to take this guy out? I kind of want to take him out. Kinda got a grudge. Good news, the sniper rifle stun locks him. Yes. It does just enough damage per hit to initiate a stun. I'm sorry that may have felt like a dirty fight for you. That you, um... I love dirty fights. That you did it, um, more my way than your way. If it works, it works. I don't have the ammo to do it my way. Don't forget, you got the ball. Might be the last opportunity I get to. Pretty close to it, yes. Play with your iron horse balls. Not go too crazy here. Oh, okay. Ah. 
You gotta start tilting that in advance. Mm -hmm. God damn it. That is probably the most difficult part of this. You can also rotate the puzzle around different... You can look at it from different directions. Oh. I didn't know that. This is the last one, isn't it? Yes. But hey, you learned something could do by the time you really needed it. I learned something could do? Something new. You said could do? <laughs> and I know you made something you can do, but... You can do. <laughs> I don't like that blind spot. <laughs> Miss your train? <laughs> it's funny, I'll give you that. I'll give it to you. I nearly ramped the gear. Um. um. Can, can you chill? Can you find your chill, please? There is no chill. <laughs> now what? Oh, I see. I, okay. <laughs> uh, I saw the gap in the rail like a second too late. So, Ethan, how'd you, uh, how'd you like the ball puzzle? Was, was it fun? Yeah, man, I really liked it. It was pretty challenging. But, you know, not like impossible. He's like, yeah, 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 you get it. Also, I fucking hate your ball game. <laughs> Sidney, then, roll my balls gently. I know they're made of iron, but it's still a sensitive game. Oh, what's that face, Ethan? Don't you like ball gags? Uh, uh, <laughs> I'm impressed. That was that was good. Sounds good. Ball gags. Mm. What? What the fuck was that? You'd been getting past a hazard without even being able to see it until then. You know, Ethan, I didn't even make this puzzle. Some nut job who designed the castle did. And don't get me wrong, I'm a nut job. This guy, though, he had serious balls. It's a joke, Ethan! You don't like jokes! Sit down! <laughs> Drink your tea and lemonade! I feel like I'm getting progressively worse at this puzzle the more it goes on. Come on you can you can do it. No, no, calm calm your balls. Yes. I was getting past that so much easier last time, but I couldn't see it. <laughs> I'm sorry, everyone. This is not the riveting gameplay y'all were hoping for. 
I'm pretty stoked. Just like watching people suffer. No, I like watching people overcome adversity. I thought you were about to say, no, I like watching you suffer. There's a difference. <laughs> <laughs> That camera tilt, mmm. My hands are sweating more now than they were in that fucking fight. Is there a way to cheat? If there is, I don't know it. Don't ask me how I just phased through that. You don't have to complete this puzzle to finish the game. I don't. But I did all the others. Alright. And I got... You get a good chunk of money, and I might need to upgrade a weapon to make the boss fight easier. It will indeed make the boss fight easier. Completing this puzzle. Yes. This is exactly the riveting gameplay I came here for. I'm here to laugh at your suffering. Oh, thanks, honey. <laughs> I'm going to try and do this like the way I was doing it. And clearly, that is not the way. Uh, you just drop the ball. It, it's okay. How's everyone in chat doing tonight? You're swell. Let me try just shutting off my brain, just saying like, yeah, fuck it. This puzzle's starting to get to him a little bit, folks. <laughs> Now the car. You're close now. Oh. Uh, victory. Oh, the blister skull. I should probably do touching this with my bare hands. You're made of mold. You might be fine. I love it. You're made of mold. Thanks for a second. You might be fine. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right. Whoa, victory. And go out here to the Duke. Sell this shit. Save. Yes. Oh, yes. <laughs> Polycrystal Skull, three mechanical hearts, uh, two perfect Heisenbergs. I'm going to hold off on that one. I'm going to sell that separately. Sold separately. Oh, you've brought in something special. He doesn't. It's Heisenberg's remains he's got a special line for. Aww. Securing goods is more important than anything. Anything. That's a handy update. This simple modification can be done in just a moment. <laughs> he just pulls up the paperwork for it, marks it out, writes 2500. There we go. I've upgraded your D&D &D character sheet. <laughs> now your gun does more. Da this whole thing is just the Duke just playing a D&D &D sesh with his friends. <laughs> Due to my rare genetic condition, I can't really leave the house. So it's so fun to play these D and D games with my friends via video chat. No, no Moreau, you don't eat the dice. No, stop that. Sorry, Moreau is my pet goldfish. I wrote him his own character sheet, but he's still an idiot. Oh, I can't do any more upgrades. Yet. Yeah. Oh, I, I can upgrade the ammo capacity on this and get some more bullets. You could. Yeah. Or something like this. Any more? God, I bought all the supplies. Oh, that's the shotgun, isn't it? The new yes. one. Yes. I don't think I need it this gameplay. I really wanted the pistol. Good day, then. Good day. Now, do you know where we need to go? No idea. What key items can we picked up? Heisenberg's key. Yes. Yeah. Be 
Because there's a door up there I need to get through with his key. Yes. Yay! See, you were just trolling I'm me. Alert. No, I was slow thinking. So, question. Yes. Hmm. Gears of War is on Game Pass. Yes. And I believe, even on the Xbox Series X, it's probably split screen co op. Interested in stringing that sometime in the future. I am. Because I found that uh, the cheap off-brand controllers, which would be yours, it's like 25 bucks. Oh, excellent. It's not bad. Oh, the key goes in upside down. That's because we're in Europe. You unlocked it. Okay, I wish he would have said that. He's like, you unlocked it. I was like, who, who, who are you talking to, Ethan? You really are a tough one. That rumbling. But I'm tired of chit chat. Time to die. Check the room first. You can hear it, can't you? Someone waiting for you. Airman. I better shut that to be polite. Prototype. Sturm. Used a cheap turboprop engine, but he's impossible to control. All he does is charge. Too much power output from the reactor? Completely invincible head on. But the dumbass managed to chop his own damn arms off on the propeller. Also, issues with overheating from running for long periods of time. Conclusion, a complete failure. But keeps him around anyway? You just scrap him for parts or put a new piece on him? Sentimentality even. Um, you know what? I'm going to go back to the Duke and save, since I grabbed all those goodies. Maybe pick up more items along the way. Will you backtrack and save again? Maybe. So, apparently, you can't do anything to his front. Right. You have to hit him in the back. And he does tire out. Yes. Can he even fit through these holes? He says you find him in the halls. Clearing a little space for you. You boat. Notice the pattern here. Ole. Doing little engine rooms. Mm -hmm. Well, he did chop his arms off. Yeah. Turn or anything? I think it's going to be a little different now. You know, just a little. It's possible to get shots off on him while he's like this, but it, you don't have as many openings. The walls will protect you from the fire. Over oh, the fire on the ground. It goes out after a little bit. Ah. Get clear. Where am I supposed to get my shots off on them? Remember that other issue Heisenberg mentioned? Overheating? Yeah.
Honestly, it's probably for the best you're heavily using the shotgun here. The boss fight after this one really does not favor that weapon at all. Out of ammo. If you can pull it off, probably not right now, but... Yeah, if you can get shots on it from behind the pistol, it's pretty quick. I think mines will do some damage to him. I'm not sure how much. Can you not go through the metal? I guess not. Hey, I'm your biggest Fire fan. Gun. I was going to say, now that he's in this phase, if we get stuck to the wall, you could try a rifle round at him. Yeah, back to handgun for this part. Can he see me? I... Is he just hearing? I don't think he could hear anything over that. Probably can't hear you. He... His, from the way he runs, I question how well he sees you. Or maybe he's just so uncoordinated that I he can can't... almost see a head? makes um, Heisenberg and Lady D but what they have in common here huh. they have actual minion bosses hmm. but Naviento and Moreau did not Bro, I'm not stupid. You can't cut through metal, just stone. Got some shots on him. This is almost a sad boss fight. It kind of is. Stay down. 
Aww. Sad propeller noises. Oh, it actually looks like a heart like you would draw. Yeah. That's... Wow, he, he didn't even have a proper heart. So it looks like the far corners have safe zones. Yes. Nice. What's this? Oh. And behind you. You mean right there? I, I thought I saw an item near there, too. Near... Yeah, right here. Handgun. Wow. No wonder he hated you. That was main. <laughs> Can I craft some... You can. I can. While the shotgun won't help you that much in the next boss fight, it could be pretty good in the one after it. Look around this room very carefully. God, look how much ham ammo I have. Yes. Ham, ham gam ammo. Ham gams. Ham yeah. gam. Got them ham gams. Cigar. Mm -hmm. Do I give this to the Duke? Yes. Okay. Miranda is abominable. Her deceit knows no bounds. End of diary. <laughs> we are merely a bunch of failed Cadeau experiments to her. I was just lucky I had more affinity to the stuff than the other poor schmucks in the village. So she still calls me her son. What a joke. I'll never forgive her for what she did to me. That crazy bitch has never been right in the head. She can't see a difference between experiment and family. Miranda didn't just change my body, she took my dignity. If I don't kill her, then my life will never be my own. Still, she may be crazy, but she's also powerful. She can turn into anyone using the Mega My Seat. Trick is that brat Rose. If I could access her power, then maybe. Speaking of, kid's dad, Ethan, has a pretty interesting body himself. Maybe I could get him to help me out. I think there's a hidden passage in here. I wouldn't have noticed that unless you said something. Oh. Enough to make a little more. Oh, yeah. That's the stuff. Oh, yeah. I'm betting I don't get to see the Duke again before I'm going to head back to the Duke. I want to save. You sure you can do that? Yeah, door's open. Okay. Oh, but is the other door open? Yeah, it's ripped right off the fucking hinges. He just walked right past the Duke! <laughs> uh, sorry, what? I was... Sleeping. Seeking something in particular. Hey, buddy, I got a prize for you. I'm gonna sell this. It's a car. In Cuba, it's really damp. And buy it, I will. Aw. It's got a Heisenberg symbol on it. Food is life. Hmm. Shotgun ammo capacity. Ammo, ammo capacity. Sniper rifle, ammo capacity. Ammo, ammo capacity. Oh, my ammo launcher! You mean your <laughs> gun? <laughs> what will that do? Give me three extra bullets? Um, 12 to 15. Yeah, that's already fully loaded. 8 to 10, that'll give me two extra. Not bad drill. Sniper. I think I have a lot of sniper rounds right now. Yes, you do. You might want to make use of in the grenade launcher in the next boss fight. I hear you. Eh, screw it. Alright, the shotgun's not going to be worthless in the next yes. fight, but your other weapons will shine more. Yeah, it's, it's called... Flare. Flare. <laughs> the flash. Muzzle flash. Muzzle flash. Oh, alright. Muzzle flash. Well, in Europe, they call it a muzzle flare. <laughs> Delighted to. I do want to eventually fully upgrade this gun. I'm still missing two parts, though. Please come again. 
Oh, trust me, I will, Dookie. It was an interesting boss fight. Yeah. This looks like where I fought Nemesis. Wait, was that me or was that somebody else? Oh yeah, Ethan definitely fought Nemesis. By the way, there was um There's a change to Carl not Carlos, um to Luis's history in RE4 remake. Hmm. Have you ever started playing it? No, I haven't, but... No. Okay, I was gonna say, man, I, I, man, I don't want to miss that. Although, knowing everything else, I'll probably be at work. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, the Juno Cannon! Yeah, what about his history? Um... About the job he had... Well, about what his previous job was. Hmm. Not a Madrid cop. He, um, he was a scientist for Umbrella. Oh. The European branch. One of the reasons that Sadler was interested in him is he's had experience working with parasites before. One very famous parasite. Nemesis. Yes. I figured from context clues. We finally made it in this room. Huh? Oh! Oh! Yeah, we're back on the first floor. Oh, oh man, you weren't kidding about this taking hours to get through that door. Mm-hmm. You think he likes the sound of all the industrial stuff? Maybe. Is it unlocked now? What the? Uh, it's about to be... <gasps> Come on, Ethan, don't look so unhinged! Is he building a Metal Gear Rex? You're persistent, but I've got a rebellion. So stay out of my way. He's not just outright killing you. He's just like, hey, stay out of my way. His flesh. With the robo suit. Kind of funny you mentioned Middle Gear Rex. He has turned himself into a giant cyborg. As easily as he did it, I'm wondering if he can undo it just as easily. Maybe. He's had every opportunity to kill you, and he hasn't. Yeah. He's just like, all right, look, just stay out of my way at least. I want to think it's because... He's happy you killed everyone else for him? He sees you as a... a useful wild card. He looks up to me. I am also like him, but not under control, and he's like... Then of the three fingers. Ethan, what are you doing? I told you to leave it alone, Ethan. You are in the way. Jokes on you, that's not even my gun. Here, Chris. You killed my wife, you son of a bitch. You think I killed Mia? That wasn't her. It was Miranda. And... What? She's a bioweapon. Why did he wait so long to tell us this? She changed her appearance and pretended to be Mia. Seems she also survived being shot, so now I'm here Sorry, to finish the job. Sorry, did you take tank treads at a Hemi Bullshit. engine and load up a chainsaw you and a shotgun to right it? Right away, because I knew you would want to be involved. And this job is hard enough without civilians getting in the way. Why us, Chris? Why are you going to pop your collar like some cringy emo? Yeah. 
I guess I owe you an explanation. You owe me a lot more than that, but we'll start with an explanation. Give me that wrench. He looks like he's trying to build something that he drew when he was in middle school. This would be my ultimate death tank. I did a chainsaw and a rocket launcher. Miranda's fucking insane. In this village, all these monsters and freaks, this is her life's work. Some sort of crazy experiment with the mold. Is that even Chris's voice actor? Louisiana. Um, God damn it. I think the one from RE7. All this time, I thought I could save my family. I can't escape from here. I can't do anything. Yeah, you're a civilian. Fuck you. As soon as we kill the rest of the lieutenants, I'll save the day. Uh, yeah, Chris, about that. Take a look at this. My men sent those pictures a few minutes ago. Miranda. Keep looking. Rose. Holy shit, we gotta go! Relax, my men are monitoring the situation. But they have my daughter. Yeah, and? Get it, Ethan. You don't stand a chance against Miranda by yourself. <laughs> Oh shit, that was my only rocket. <laughs> Could have just opened the garage and saved down, ammo. Finish planting explosives. You take that elevator. I'll meet you topside. I promise you we will get your daughter back. We need her. Together. She's Damn a valuable she. weapon. And when I find Miranda, she's a dead woman. He's like, really? A pistol? That's cute. You see the rocket launcher, right? right? Even I don't think we stand a chance. This. And do me a favor. Try to stay under the radar. With this? Stay under the radar! With this! You? Lifted straight out of it. Twisted Metal took place in the Mad Max universe. Stay under the radar. Don't examine it yet. Does it have stealth capabilities? Ethan has gone around murdering... almost the whole damn village. Stay under the radar? Yeah, about that. I'm pretty sure I destroyed the radar. To Hound Wolf Squad. Really? Hound Wolf... Okay, they clearly came up with their own names. Sweep of the factory is complete. No proof of any connection with the organization. Guess they just wasn't... This just wasn't our lucky day. I did manage to get my hands on a number of documents disclosing some of Miranda's experiments, which support our previous theories. Also, I found a fucking chainsaw. She seems to have infected herself with the mutamycete, which has granted her a number of abilities, including... Mimicry. She can turn into a treasure chest and eat people. A little behind the times, but still pretty cool. She can control her cells and transform herself to look like anyone or anything. This whole time she's been Ethan and didn't even know it. That would be a twist. She disguised herself as Mia and infiltrated the winter Zinzin's home. Her objective was clearly to kidnap Rose. Maybe she thought she could control Rose easier if she looked like a mom. When we attacked it, put a little damper on her plan, so she mimicked a corpse. It would, be, it would make more sense if so she played dead. She then revived herself in the transport truck, killed everyone on board, and took off with Rose. Things didn't go the way she had originally planned, but in the end, she still got what she wanted. I don't know why I added that to the report. I probably should have just left that out. Until now. It's time to rendezvous and blow this place sky high. This might turn into a fight with Heisenberg, but I think I found something useful. Look at one of his little toys laying around. So it is a toy made by a child! Lying around, and it's even made from a metal polymer composite, which he can't control. How convenient. We're gonna call this Heisenberg's gun? Sure. What is that meme or trope where, like, you find something and, like, later it's super important? Chekhov's gun? Chekhov's gun. Yeah, Heisenberg's toy. Chekhov's now, gun. I think there might be a few items to pick up around here. Why would Heisenberg make something out of something he couldn't manipulate? Like, so you're telling me every single piece of this is made from something he can't control, so it had to be built by hand. It may not have enough metal parts to... enough metal concentrated in it to be controlled. I don't... That still sounds stupid. Yeah, it does sound dumb that Heisenberg would build it. I would think it would be better if it was like, oh yeah, Heisenberg, like, uh, I found one of Heisenberg's, like, earliest toys or creations. I think he would be a little reluctant to tear it apart by hand, but he might actually be excited to fight it. <laughs> that would be cooler. It's like, I'm going to let you have that, Ethan. Let's see what you got. 
If you can take me down, what chance did I have of fighting Miranda? See how easy that script was? Yeah. I guess that's everything. Oh. Yeah, that's not where you were. Oh, yeah, that's where I was. Maybe if I go through there? No, you'll need the... Well, I mean, like, if there were items in here. Yeah, I think I got everything. Okay. So, are you ready for BattleBots? Bro, you know it. BattleBots. Real bots. Real... Chin, or is it real battles? I don't know. I don't remember. I haven't seen it in ages. I really hated the scoring system in it, because it was always like... Uh, people would exploit, oh, it's number of hits earns you points, so they would just create tiny jackhammers that didn't do any damage. It's like, oh, you got like five million hits in. It's like, oh, we made a ramp bot, so it just goes under them and flips them over with the spatula mode. I'm like, and then every robot started doing that. It's like, this is a viable. So yeah, later seasons of BattleBots were very boring. The early seasons were fun. <laughs> you ready? Yeah. <laughs> this looks like something I drew in middle school. Another weird thing you have in common with Heisenberg. Metal polymer composite, huh? Time to fight fire with metal fire. Metal polymer composite, huh? It's made of plastic. Oh, this'll work. You're I'm coming, shitting me. <laughs> <laughs> this should have been in the last level of the home improvement game. I'm just picturing, like, that meme where the kid's like on the computer turns and looks and thumbs up, but it's the Doom guy holding the controller, looks over. <laughs> Brady Cannon, Fire Cannon. Nope. So, Wait, guard? Try your guard. You got a chainsaw shield. So I can't just attack with it, that's just my block. I think it does damage if it comes in contact with something, though. Fire. Okay, so this is the cannon. And just... Yes. Oh! That should That's not have that much kick. Yeah. For as heavy as this thing ought to be? Thunk! Hey, Ethan, can you just chainsaw the... Uh... Oh, okay, thank you. So, yes, there's a cooldown time on the cannon. I think you got one. Got three. Hit the reds for bonus points. <laughs> Can you imagine, like, eight-year-old Heisenberg just going through the village? What? Oh, is it storming? Storm. Are you shitting me? Yeah. Do I have to bust this open with a rocket You do. Launcher? I'm waiting till it reloads before I go out there. Why is he just waiting out there, though? Seriously. He should be all the way to Miranda by now. He should be, yes. You're like a goddamn cockroach! You think you can take me on? great. Yes. So he has. When he's coming at you, either block or fire the cannon into one of his weak points, especially. Is the red glory part? It is. I'm the. Did he just say this is the best? I'm the best! So you can use the cannon to blow away part of his shield. But, uh, sustained a machine gun fire on his, um... On openings? On his, op on his weak spot openings will, uh... Yeah, you want to aim for the machine gun at the red spot, too. So the heavy red sparks are a good sign. Yes. Yeah. I can block and fire. <laughs> Red spot. Oh, 
Seriously, I can just block and fire. He just looks a little creepy though. I don't lie. Man, you can stay in cringy teenager mode. Is he regrowing? He's pulling in more metal to replace the his wounds. Phase two? Getting there, yes. Oh, I had no idea what was happening. Ready? Cannon. Oh, my mega tank. Whoa, dude! Come on, not cool. How does he even know about that? I'm guessing Sheva must have laughed. Who else would have done it? So, the stuff that's fallen down, the debris, that can be used for cover. It'll take one of the hits for you. If I can get there. You know, you have to fight him with your own weapons. Flesh and blood will never win against me! This is indeed a goliath. The landmines work? No, I don't think they will. I don't think they'll hit his weak points at least. He's so fucking big. Ethan, could you pick up the pace a little? He's just like, oh, beautiful weather we're having. <laughs> okay, I don't have any more cover. I keep shooting. Oh, he might be moving on to the next phase. Yeah, he is. You really should have taken my deal. You know, I kind of see that now. Oh, like the fan fight. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry, buddy. I was a fan of yours, too. I, I really was. They started their own stupid writing. Yeah. Never mind. It neck that's all. <laughs> Armored Core 6. Sneak Creek footage. Crystal Heisenberg. We've been trying to get a hold of you about your car's insurance. His name's Alpha. I heard explosions. What the hell happened? I dealt I... with Heisenberg. Now I'm gonna find Miranda and get Rose back. Not without me. It's too dangerous. Fuck you. Wait there, you hear me? No. Ethan? Rose? Uh, this is a crap. Oh shit, what is that behind her? A child. <laughs> She's so important, isn't she? She's everything to me. <laughs> and mine to me. With Heisenberg gone, 
You've lost your lead. What are you going to do? I don't know, but I'm saving Rose. So is Mia already dead? Do you? Even when I took Mia's place in your home. Poor Ethan. Who are you? Where's Rose? <laughs> Enough. Wow, you're ugly. Remember Evelyn and her power over them all? Mia was cute. Rose I didn't like Mia. Successor. No. Rose is Evelyn's true, complete form. She will grow to be fully. <laughs> and I must die. Evelyn, Evelyn. Who was that one? Fuck you, you crazy bitch! The little girl from seven. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Calm yourself. Rose will be saved. The Mega My Seat catalogs all of us. However, she will be reborn as my daughter. She's my child, not yours. Where are you? So technically, you're also Why did part Rose of the come to be? Mega My Seat. Was it because of her parents? Mm. And you are truly special. So he's like, I've all I can. is he like a rare 100% compatibility with the my seat? Not sure. Miranda, you coward. Come on and face me. I'm right in front of you. She is the growth. Don't worry. Your death will come quick. You will join the Mega My Seat's records. I will make sure to sample your blood for death. Once dawn breaks, the ceremony will be complete. So she's going to break down Rose mother. into the Bound fungus archives that. and then, like, <laughs> impregnate herself with Rose's DNA? No. There's a file coming up. It's still dumb. I've waited so long. But dreams really can come true. <clears throat> I can't wait to see my true child again. I'm guessing she's, she's lost a going child. to try to upload the Megamyces records of her daughter into Rose. Man, if they would just stop using this for like the death of Ethan Winters. I wasn't able to apocalypse really level shit. It's like the Megamyces looks like, it could advance humankind so well. Situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda. This all happened in a day? <laughs> Ethan did all this in a day? And Chris is talking down to him. Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. Mm. And she is not gonna get away with it. I have a feeling Ethan's not dead. I'm hoping not, because I don't want to play as this bastard. Damn it, when does it end? Ethan hops into the car seat. Spencer, the mission? All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. And Ethan did all that in a day? Three years too long. Yeah, it really was. He also did a hell of a lot of the work in Louisiana. Yep. That's probably the most realistic looking cigarette I've ever seen in a video game. Also, is Chris unaware that his sister... Did a pretty good job two times. Sorry, city work doesn't count as real work. I hope he's not really like that, but I got it. So hate BSAA Chris. got here already. They didn't waste any time. Mission adjustment. Doesn't he work no, with BSAA? Or they are separate organizations. He did. And rescue Rose. That's. I'm mission. so glad you guys wore your fur coats and blue jeans to this mission. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Okay. okay. K9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. 
Roger that. So there's a massive explosion in a potential threat area. They've probably been monitoring. No! What was the last? Are we done here? <laughs> yeah, we're done. Wrap it up. <laughs> it's only for a little bit. It better be! I hate this guy! Were you there when we played six? I hate him! Were you there when we played six? I know what I said. Nope. Did you check out mentally as a defense mechanism? I missed the bullshit. I missed that stream. <laughs> Good. It was a garbage game. I feel like we should play more garbage games. That was fun. Rest the desert. Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. But thanks to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard she turned herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at either. Spooky. Sp Don't you guys deal with bioweapons all the time? Yeah. I once fought a monster that grabbed a rocket out of the air that I fired at it. Then it blew it up in its face. And then laughed. Okay. Is that spooky to you? Oh yeah, Chris is a different arsenal. Okay, he's got five grenades. Whatever the fuck this is. That's for satellite strike. Machine gun. And... Wow, a real ugly tactical pistol. You can open up the menu and have a closer look if you want. Ooh, the Uzmai. The semi-automatic gun that Chris has customized for equally high power, accuracy, and firing rate. So he added all this extra junk to a perfectly good gun? Okay. Oh, and look, you put a little wolf on there. I'm a lone wolf. I travel alone in a pack of other lone wolves. <laughs> if you can't tell, I don't like this guy. Dragoon. An easy to handle, fully automatic, capable rifle with the shortest barrel possible. What? Short barrel? Why does that seem like he's bragging about it? And bro, did you really tape that on the handle? Why? What? Alright, that's clearly a long-range laser sight. On the left and right-hand side? What? Chris, no, wait. Okay, the left is a tactical light, the right is a laser sight, and there's a scope up top. This is a safe way to look at a gun, by the way. I do like that it's got some wear and tear to it. Like in the middle. Mm -hmm. It's like scuffs and pings and stuff. That's alright. Oh, and he brought his pin light. That'll help. Yeah. Hey. Grenade. Hand. Frag. Delay. Best if used by 717-1919. Ah, oh, well, I guess you got these in bulk. Because the pin is rusted. That's friendly. Yeah. He's also got a different knife. Oh no. This looks like one of those fucking gas station knives. Hey man, you wanna see a really cool knife? I got it here in this plastic case. Next to the not bongs and not bowls for smoking drugs. This is great for close combat. No way. This looks like those like edgy try hard knives it does do a little more damage than the kitchen knife Ethan uses well yeah because we're he's being swung by the boulder puncher himself <laughs> the donkey puncher what no treasure no no because no one loves you so you're exactly where Ethan started in the village oh I thought that was the the shaman woman. I'm just hey, Alpha, like, really? Look at this. Hey, Alpha, look at this. Is this scope dirty to you? The SAA. You're going too far. <laughs> like it out of the way. Looks pretty rough down there. How did you not recover from that? It just no First, shoot. We're gonna have to take that thing out. I got your back, boss. Let's get to work. We're all gonna die, aren't we? Yes, you are, random soldier number three. Mapmatician. Oh. Um. Yay? So, the village is on fire. Fuck 
Is it the explosion they caused at Heisenberg's factory? Huh? It's contact. probably a combination of Did they drop shit? No. I'm just gonna unload all my ammo. Fuck it, I don't care. You are able to um, purchase these weapons Chris is using with just points that can't be upgraded. So they're at max capacity. Max power, yeah. Alright. Which isn't bad considering how easily I'm killing these things with a pistol. Now, um, Ethan's in-game weapons are hmm, more powerful, but you've got to fully upgrade them. Look for the green glow if you want more supplies. This is supposed to be like the god mode section. Don't get cocky. Don't get cocky. This is meant to be an overtuned version of the Mia part of RE7. Where, oh yeah, Mia's got a machine gun. Don't you feel so powerful? No, no, I fucking hate that machine gun. Who's here? What the hell is that thing? It's all new to my seat. When something particularly nasty shows up, I recommend running past Let's go. them. Oh? Even as... Uh... S tier Chris. Like these, run past them. Keep going. Large mutated bioweapon sight. Was that one of the Barkalax, yes. They won't pursue you here. Roger. At least I don't think they will. If you're playing higher than normal, you will need these. No. Funny enough, the Chris section gets very hard compared to Eth everything Ethan does. Oh, I would have loved a warning for this. Yeah. On hard and perfect. I think there's hard and village of shadows. Anyway, those, um, I find this section harder than Ethan's stuff. Because throwing all the big things at you. Also, remember, Chris doesn't get his weapons any more powerful than they already are. Man, I really gotta take a shit. But I don't have to, because I'm awesome. My muscles are so strong, I just squash the shit into air. Doing it now. You will have to head into that building. Down the hill. This one? No, the one down the hill. The right. To the right here. Oh! I didn't even see that door. I'm sorry. Get ready. That reload will feel like it takes forever in a bit. I love that little slide they do. Yeah. It's so cute. Umberize, I need some backup. I see you. 200 to the point. 200 what? Don't understand. Oh, God, I can use a drink right now. Wait, didn't he have a drinking problem? In five. No, it was like in six. They found him, like, at a bar or something. Yeah. And they copied that plot for Leon in a movie later. They did! I remember that shit! I remember that looked familiar. I'm glad the movie, the animated movies are not canon. The live action are? Okay, don't. No. When they draw a flaming arrow to fire, it looks so badass. 
when you shoot a flaming arrow by accident out of the sky, it looks so badass. It does. What do you say? I've heard I of a meta colony growing. So it's a good idea that when you can to keep both guns loaded because you may have to switch between them to fend off foes. Yeah, I'm noticing that. We're going down one of those streets where you think got ambushed earlier. Hey, uh, bro, you alright? Alright, cool, just checking. That was the blocked path I saw earlier, just on the other side of it. Also, um, early on, Ada was slated to be in this game. Really? But they scrapped that idea. Not a bad idea. Okay, you weren't kidding. That reload is garbage. Yeah. Is the other gun reloaded? Ethan has better reload strategy than this. Alright, sorry, I'm late. Oh, oh no. Wow, I actually got hit in. I can die with no regrets. I think that they, although it's a bit slow, they will keep spawning. Oh, okay. That's nice way of fair and saying stop fucking around. I thought the Chris section in the uh, free DLC of seven was decent. Reach the target location. Damn, this is big. All right, Lobo. Marking the target. Now we use the fancy thing. Good thing all those guys behind me just gave up. Now, they're going to start spawning in while you wait for the reload. You'll have to fight them conventionally. Uh, there is another supply crate. Down that way? Yeah. No, I've not seen that happen before. Don't be afraid to make use of a uh, grenade in the port. Oh, it's open for fire again. Trying to get hit, it will interrupt this. Rapidly expanding. There must be something stimulating. Get over here. Looks like it's about to collapse. Hold your horses. I'm reloading. I'm trying to find this spike. Oh, is it in here? Yes. Just jump off the building, but he's gonna be safe without it. Yeah. PSA guys are engaging the bioweapons. You're right, Captain, they must be after the Megamycete too. Ah. He uses a health injector. Everyone okay? They're coming from the Break. They're getting back up. That was the last time. It is a bitch doing this on hard, especially that last one. Yeah, I don't think I'll be doing that. Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. So, uh, we blow a crater or we just knocked it down? Caused it to forcibly retreat? 
I'm going so. in. The rest of you stay back. So most of this damage Captain, is just caused by it digging. The village with a sample from the bakers and uh, and I got this here. I don't know. Of the genome editing we saw in the E series. The stuff originated here. Huh? Wait, what else did I pick up? Oh, med injectors. Mm -hmm. I didn't saw them. Okay. Okay. Wow. Uh, Look at your ammo. Yeah. Depending on hard mode, that's barely enough. Sure wish I had a grenade launcher. Civilian like Ethan wouldn't know how to handle that kind of hardware. Oh. I fucking hate that. Yeah. When, when you're clearly doing better and they're just like, well, what do you know? I was like, I'm doing your job. Better than you. <clears throat> it's, it's infuriating. That's the mayor of Townsville, isn't it? It's, uh, I think his brother. Is he just, like, trapped down here? Not so much trapped as preserved. In case he was needed? Yes. I got a tough guy here. I'm gonna need backup. Boss, you're on the ground. There's an opening in the roof. Use it. Okay, I'm moving out. So you've got to stagger this guy a bit, then use your lock-on weapon. Back is a weak point. I'm overhead, boss. Good. I'll signal with the locator. This fight might be easier in first person. And yes, they had him survive that somehow. He might be. out of Elden Ring. Yes. Oh, there is a weapon like it. It's rusty, too. It also looks like some stuff you can make in Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, I think I've made some. Yes. And then a teenage boy can have it.
Are you serious? Yeah. Is it body a weakness now? Rule of Where should I next? I'll keep going. The rest of you, stay above ground. I'm keeping this. I could use it as a weapon. Gunshot is always looking for friends. So if Miranda was the fake Mia, where's the real one? I doubt she saw any further use for her. I don't get any of this. How did Miranda even know Rose exists? A moldy little bird told her, maybe? We can figure that out later. How did Focus she on the plan. It's never revealed. Is there like a calling? I found it. It's the Megamycete. It looks like a... Fetus. Is that just like because it absorbed enough human blood that it's I starting to archive itself? Don't know why it looks like that. Coincidence? Maybe. Ugh, it's hideous. Alpha the squad. I've located the Megamycete. There's light coming through. You should be able to just like shoot it. I thought he pulled out a knife. He did. <sighs> it just Two falls out. Oh. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Let's get out of here and blow the damn place. Not before I end Miranda. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. I mean, this would definitely damper her plans. Captain, I have eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give the order. I know it's too late now. They should have told Ethan the plan. There wasn't time. We didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even so, doesn't even impact. You have nope. told him. Yeah. Is this poop? Is it? It looks a bit like the stuff Moreau makes, doesn't it? Does he control a version of the Metamind seat? Yes. The sludge. He's. Due to his mutations, he has different effect abilities. They all do. Yeah. This must be Miranda's lab. There are a lot of files here. Okay. Salvatore Moro. Cattle affinity, low. Brain functions, surprisingly low. Wow. The Cagado has caused drastic changes to internal organs, transforming them to organs similar to fish-like gills in the swim bladder. Another subject with a regular cell division, causing him to transform into a giant fish. The subject is unable to control this transformation to too many defects, an unfit vessel for Ava. I feel like I can take that out. It's very Cthulian. Yes. I, I guess I can't take it out. The mermaid is Moreau's symbol. This is just to give you an appreciation of the design. Alcina Dimitrescu. Cado affinity. Most favorable. Brain functions normal. Regeneration rate is incredibly fast. The subject can heal any external wound within seconds and grow nails into claws in mere moments. Rapid regeneration also means an increased body size. Does it? Okay. Hmm. Due to hereditary blood disease, the subject must ingest human flesh and blood on a regular basis to maintain regeneration properties. Suspect the subject's regeneration is not properly balanced and she may mutate uncontrollably. An unfit vessel for Ava. That's why she called them all her children. Yes. Aww. See, a lot of work went into this book. Mm-hmm. Carl Heisenberg, Keto Affinity, incredibly favorable. Brain functions, normal. You think they'd be higher? Mm. All right. Has electric organs similar to the electric ray, Naka Japonica. These electric organs are connected to the subject's nervous system and therefore pass and control electricity throughout the entire body, allowing control of magnetic fields, which is used to move metal. Splendid specimen. 
unfit vessel for Ava. Wait a minute. Didn't be into. Oh, right. Donna Beneviento. Favorable, normal, although severe mental illness. Physically, she is no different from a regular human. However, she can secrete a signal-producing substance which controls plants infected by the mutamycete. When humans absorb the pollen from a particular flower, she can cause them to have hallucinations. However, she is mentally undeveloped and has divided her cadeau among her dolls in order to control them from a distance. Untithest for Ava. Why she needed those ornate books just for a few notes on these people is... I I'm sure there's more. There's Moreau. So... Using this to control the bioweapons. The... Where did these come from? Do they... Is that they what's dripping at the off, bottom? They come off the Megamycete. They just kind of bud and then drop? That's my guess. Is that what that slime is at the bottom? Where they drop down and that she collects I them? I don't know about... Young Miranda, yeah, I'm okay with that. I'm down. Is that her daughter? Yes. Why are they experimenting on her? That's Eva. No, sorry, that's um, Evelyn. Oh, was Evelyn her daughter? No. Evelyn was grown in a lab, but not by Miranda. She would have done it right. Oh, she must have traveled here to the mountains. Yes. That looks like traveling gear. Dear Miranda, my deep apology is not meeting in person. I would love nothing more than to visit your quaint village once more. However, I'm incredibly busy. Then again, I suppose for an immortal woman such as yourself, you no longer remember this poor half-dead medical student in the snow. I always cherish the revelations I came to 15 years ago when I stayed in your village. Inspired by your research, to think one could transform a human by infecting them with an organism. Positively visionary. I knew that with that knowledge I could achieve my own vision for the next step in human evolution. Even after two world wars and humanity on the cusp of another, my conviction never wavered. I realized, however, through the many nights of intellectual talks you and I shared, that your conviction differed from mine. You hope to bring back a single dead person, while I aim to change the world. Your experience on the mold would not have aided me in my endeavor to achieve an exponential infection. I thought a virus would be more effective. This is why I had to leave you. I still regret never telling you goodbye. My apologies for reminiscing. I actually have news that I thought might please you. I have found the key to evolution. The progenitor, a virus found in Africa. I plan to start a company with friends and colleagues dedicated to the virus's research. I will call it Umbrella, just like the symbol in the cave that we spoke about. I'm one step closer to making my vision a reality. I hope you will be able to achieve your goal someday, too. You taught me so much, and that I'll be forever in your debt. Sincerely, your lifelong student, Oswell E. Cobblepot. <laughs> <laughs> the penguin. Yeah, he lost all his money when Umbrella got shut down. <laughs> and he looks horrible, like a mutant. Spencer, here. No way. Yes way. I just realized he sounds like Keanu Reeves. So... The timeline now is apparently that Spencer, as a medical student, came out here, possibly hearing rumors about the, the mold. He nearly froze to death. Miranda and her followers ended up saving him. His skill at medical science proved interesting to Miranda, so she didn't do anything to him. Allowed him to learn. This is full of all the dead bodies. And he was inspired by the uh, umbrella symbol, which still hasn't been defined in this game. They were old monster hunters. Because apparently, it's possible some of the actual monsters in mythology existed, and they just got hunted down. And there is a precedent for monster hunters in that dagger that you stabbed him at with. That's where I'm going. I took a picture of this disembodied head. <laughs> My Eva, it's been 100 years since I lost you to the Spanish flu. I was so powerless back then. 
But now, now I can bring you back to life from the Megamycete. I had to test her new vessel's regenerative capabilities. I took her apart and revived her in the Megamycete Regulator, the Giant's Chalice. All that's left to, is to merge her with the Megamycete. The ceremony can finally begin. After I lost you, I was so stricken with grief that I wandered into a cave to die. I so wanted to be with you again. And that's when I found it. The Megamycete! Completely by accident! When I touched the black substance, my mind was overcome with knowledge. The Megamycete breaks down and absorbs the consciousness of those who have perished. I knew that if your consciousness was in there too, then there would be a way to bring you back. I just needed the right vessel. But they didn't put her daughter's body in the Megamycete. She's just assuming people die and then go to this spiritually? Yeah. Oh, thank you very much for the raid, Harry. How are you tonight? Did you ever find your daughter? Harry Mason? Yes. Attorney at law? That's an old, old joke. Yes. Sorry. When I returned to the village, I implanted the villagers with mold from the Megamycete. That way I could control them, experiment on them. I've experimented on hundreds of people just to find you the perfect vessel. I even tried to increase the eff efficiency of finding you a vessel by creating a parasite I called Kado. Yet none of my experiments came to fruition. There were some, like Alcina, who were close to being perfect, but most turned into lichens. I was once approached by an organization who said they would assist me. I gave them some of the mold and your DNA, but all they created was another defect, Evelyn. Then again, not a complete failure. I learned of Rose thanks to them, and I knew she would be the perfect vessel. Okay, so there's how she found out. Mm -hmm. Umbrella was just like, you know what? Everyone's pissing us Not off. Umbrella, right? the connections. Oh. There was some interference, but I was able to verify her suitability. Now my research is finally complete. Eva, I've waited too long to see you again. Is that Chris on number two? No, I don't believe so. That might be Alan. Do you remember Mia's segment in 7? There was a guy she was in the room with, posing as, as Evelyn's father. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. you see Mia at the end on the right. Miranda's face looks like badly photoshopped in. I don't think Miranda's in here. Oh. Why would she... That does look like her, doesn't it? A bit, yes. But why would she be on this team? She might not. Because she can imitate anybody. She just chose to be herself. <laughs> I could be anyone, but I wanted to be me. But I'm me. And what's wrong with that? Boy, oh boy, I love it when I fall for that. I thought she was holding a dog for a minute. <laughs> I saw the fur. We took, some, we took some model shots during the Spanish flu. You know... I mean, before she started wearing the the priestess gear, Miranda did not look bad. Priestess gear looks horrible. She looks oily and sickly. Mm-hmm. It... Why? Oh, God, is that her daughter's bones? Is that where she's getting the DNA from? I guess it's possible. All of this just looks like concept art from the game. <laughs> <laughs> it might very well be. Oh, we never fought any of those, did we? But, um... Or is that Moreau? That looks like Moreau. Oh. So, um, you know, back in the day, scientists didn't have computer printouts. They often had to work with really fancy hand sketches. Yeah. When you proceed, we've got a cutscene. Okay, so we got everything, right? I think you did, yes. Okay. Who's in here? It's Ethan, isn't it? Oh, it's Mia! Show me your hands! Umbrise, this is awful. Where is Miranda right now? Still at the ceremony site. Whatever she's doing, she's staying put. God damn. It really is you. I'm getting really fucking tired of this. I'm glad you saved me. I keep winding up in red brick basements. 
I was caught. I'm used to an experiments. She's also infected. I'm pretty sure she is, but I don't know why no one ever notices it. Is it just like, oh, you're human enough, we'll just keep an eye on you and your medical records? Wait. You can't leave me here. Give me a gun. You promised, damn it. You said that you would keep us safe. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything. Why did you move them close to the source? I didn't care. Like I said, Chris is kind of a dumbass. So you tell me, where is my husband? Fuck yeah! Where is my daughter? Ethan is gone. I like it. She's not even like sad. She's pissed. And that's what I like to see. But I can save Rose. Come on. It's not safe here after all. Give her a weapon. What do you mean he's gone? Uh, he's dead. They ripped his heart out. He left for so Jamaica. He got to... real tired of this. We have to destroy this village. No, you're wrong. I tried to keep this a secret, but you don't understand how special he is. Is the my seat perfectly imitating human organs to the point that tests don't even reveal? It's never confirmed if that's the case, but it has to be because nobody would be that fucking stupid. Unless they are. <laughs> I mean, Chris is in charge of this operation. Let's be real. Presumably he's not running the tests. I hope. We got a pro bono doctor to do a bunch of this. It's really an intern, but... <laughs> so it's there. He's got his heart ripped out. Uh, wow, it feels really cold right here in this hole in my... Oh, that's that's not good. Oh, his fingers are back. Look at that. Notice it, Ethan. Also, your ring is back. I don't know how that happened. Well, never bothered me anyway. Oh. Does he not notice his fucking hand? Ethan's perception is... So oh shit. Is that Evelyn? It is. Evelyn? Kind of. How are you oh, it imprints data. Yes. Is he a walking storage cabinet? You're dead. <laughs> oh, I like you. Uh, I mean... Miranda. Is he hallucinating? Is this in his brain? That shared consciousness no. space from the first one? That's the impression I got. Wrong! It wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What are you saying? I can still... You're a memory. Isn't he? See? Miranda didn't kill you. I did. I did a damn good job of it, too. Sounds like the Baron. Remember. He got infected pretty early on, didn't he? Yes. Three years ago. At Baker House. You were murdered by Jack. You died there three years ago. So, that's, that's he's a impressive. revenant. No way. Smart zombie. Doesn't usually realize it's dead. Yeah. He shouldn't even be able to walk around. Quit messing with my head. Dude, I'm you not doing anything. be walking. <laughs> Bro, you! Oh, I love this girl. This is She's so awesome. She's so different than in Seven. What have I... She's had time to think. Is it because her, him, and Mia are both infected that Mia kinda has an idea? 
I think Mia has ulterior motives. I've always thought that Mia is not a good person. But no one seems to catch on. Now do you get it? Your whole body is nothing but mold. This whole time I was the bow. They're one game too late. I bet the majority of the fan base already figured this out before seven was over. The bow. The him bow. Cause you is dumb. I have to save my daughter. You're already dead. Dead. Just give up so I can take over your body. I thought he was starting to laugh too. I will save Go toward the light, Ethan. Shoots out the sun. Aww. What does that look like the Duke? Like a younger Duke. Oh no. He's the real father. Oh no! Oh no! At last, he awakes. I knew it! I saw the meat! Where am I? My carriage, Ethan. You were having a nice... symbol. Oh, was he like the other one? Duke? He was meant to be the fifth lord. Our battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. But to think Miranda would show herself. What's How pulling? Long have I been out? The horse you've seen How with long him. Till dawn? Duke, I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assumed as much, and I'm already on the way. Duke, you're a Should real friend. You know that. Thank you. I'm gonna make you the godfather of my child. But Ethan, I feel like she'd be safer sure that way. Your body is well, falling apart. <sighs> yes. <laughs> Foolish of me to ask. Correct. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> Even I can't quite answer that. See, I ate the Kado as a bit once, and then I got a real taste for them. I owe you one. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? What do you mean, your old world? because shit's hit the fan out here or because he's not he now knows what he is I had to the last part. so we won't be able to look around the village hey Ethan could you try I don't know regrowing those fingers I feel like that would help I left a few parting favors for you Ethan Honestly, it's just shit I couldn't pack in the carriage, but hey, they're free. Does he just keep that covered? Oh, oh there he is. How'd he... But he was... It's the Duke. No one stops him. Is he always sitting there he controls the horses mentally? No, he was up front before. As you wish. Do you have any new? Oh, you do! You do! You do! You do! You do! Kadoo! 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 You've also got lots of stuff to sell. I do choose do. wisely. Your life may depend on it. Oh, I'm so glad Chris just left this for me to pick up. Yeah. That's as inelegant as it gets. Your coin. Your coin. Ah, he didn't say the line. He does have one. Uh -huh. Ah! It actually radiates Heisenberg's essence. Meeting. Be sure you have all you need. You can make some new upgrades. Is that the pistol? I think it might be. Double check in a customized menu if you would. Okay. Here's... Yep, 
P61 custom. I'm missing a part then. <laughs> Where could it be? Do I find it later? There's not much left. Ah, we may have missed it. Yeah, I guess I, my apologies. It seems that did happen. You know what? I've been saving this for a special occasion and I can't afford it. Can't afford it. Can't. Can. Can, can. That's like a 20% increase in power? That's hefty. It can be a little tricky to use the rifle, but it's not useless in the fight ahead. Okay. Uh... Don't forget, you can also uh, purchase consumables. I should probably do that. Everything. <laughs> Just give it. <laughs> Just in case. Pipe bombs? They can work. You'll be slaughtering Landmines. In droves. I've never used them. Awesome. Life, but <laughs> your journey nears its end. How about some reckless spending to finish it off? <laughs> Duke is so awesome. Ah, uh, I'll pump up the shotgun. <laughs> Leave this to me. Yo. <laughs> All right. Please be well. Oh, thanks. That sounds like actual concern. <laughs> You're my only customer. Okay, so you're not my only customer, but you're the only one left alive. I got, I'm gonna go to the bathroom before we do this. All right. I don't want to be thinking about something else while trying to do this. You want another water? Oh, no, thank you. Sure. Well, everybody, it's just me for now. When Balefear returns, he will be heading into the final battle. I hope he's up for it. <sighs> How is everyone tonight? Well, I hope. If anyone has a free moment, uh, please type remember to block in chat. That way, uh, maybe Balefear will remember to do so during the fight. You know what, I'm here. I think I'll leave the note for him. Yeah. Not even nine o'clock yet. He's definitely going to wrap up reasonably soon. And then we must think of what to do or what for our duo stream will be next. I do hear motion up there. Whatever could it be? Yeah. 
and want to take bets on how many attempts this will take. Ah, Mr. Fear, you return. Are you ready for the last leg of the journey? Did you really type remember to block? I also asked anyone in chat who was free to do type to do so as well. Guess what? No one cares if I die. Rings. <laughs> My advice, once you can run, just run. This is a really cool pistol. Is it going to be obvious, the path? You can't go anywhere else but forward. Run. If you can. Am I Try. 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 There it goes. Just keep going. It's just coughing up little bodies. It's coughing up those um, weak enemies. Going. But they would have merely taken your image. Okay, how strong is he that you need to shove these out of the way? My beautiful daughter. Come to me. Bang, bang. Is that you? Oh, how I've missed you. Crumbles in her hands because it's not what she needed. Oh, it's just Rose, isn't it? Yeah. My power is leaving me. Rose! Oh, did Rose take over when she got put in? Maybe. Miranda! Mother is God in the eyes of the child. And you are not the mother. Your body certainly isn't normal. How could Your she not tell that? Me. No! You will see. Once I kill you properly, everything. Get her now! Thank you, statue! Uh, let go! I spent a lifetime creating this moment. Are you going to turn into a bird monster? I feel like you are. Me. I will take what is due. I think your death is due. My How about desires that? will be fulfilled! No. The power is leaving her. The power of voodoo. Voodoo? You do. Do what? Remind me of the baby? Oh, right, we're here to save a baby. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's kind of hot. Now, she dances a lot in this form. She will glide in for a melee attack pretty easily. And please do not forget to either dodge or block it. I assure you I'll provide her with truth. So now we can die peacefully. Ah. Not let him pass away. Oh, that was a lot of help. Yeah. There's nothing. Just blow it up. Actually, hide for this point. I figured you can do that here. Later, you'll see some even higher up that you have to blow up. Do headshots do anything, or it's just... I think they do a little more damage. In their spider form, the shotgun's a little more useful. Actually, don't forget you've got the Magnum. Now might be a good time to whip it out. While she's up there. Block me. The Minimicy saved me from the pits of despair. It granted me this splendid power! In her bird form, she will do dive bomb attacks. You can shoot those clusters. You want a fast weapon for it. Hold still. 
coming in. Did not get that lock in time. Oh, great mega mice! Hear my prayer! Blow it up. At least they're vulnerable for a bit. Uh-oh. If I what? kill thy rose with a mega mice, my daughter will be made manifest. Didn't she just try that? Waited a century. A century. All of the best. And right there to hide then. Yes. Why? I there are a lot of things about the plot in this game I don't like. But the, like the plot. Miranda's little ceremony bullshit falling flat on his face, I appreciate that. Because honestly it should, because it is bullshit. Get ready to block the times. Psycho. You won't I've never seen a human live without his arms. Are you sure you're not? Isn't he like a modified version? You can shoot those things. So switch back to the pistol to be quick about those. You still and there are items around the arena. I don't know if there are any healing ones. Alright, now she's pulling some Fatal Frame 3 shit. You just want to avoid everything you can right now. I think it's time you left things in my hands. The hell I will. I will take back my daughter! just restart the fight. Yes. I'm just gonna start throwing shit at her. Okay. We'll start with bombs. You fulfill Oh, I'm already at low health. That's awesome. Build your purpose, Mr. Winters. You Do I have to re-equip it or is it still my hand? You equip one full stack. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious thing of my seat. Now, please do not worry for little Rose. I assure you I'll provide her with true happiness. I hope that's important. So now you can die. Not letting you get away. Uh, no. 
definitely need more of those for sure. Yes. Uh oh. Oh! Yeah, you can, <laughs> you can uh, make a lot of pipe bombs. All oh, right, I think we're good. Engine power. Wouldn't yeah, recommend them on this phase. No. Nuts. Such vital. I'm sorry. Did was you... was that line taken from another game? Load up quick. Now she's gonna be vulnerable for a bit. The Dark God. That 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 did not come from this game. <laughs> See, the trick is to just throw everything at her. Cause really, bitch got it coming. Where's that? Okay, just got that. Now, Mr. Is there a damage in this phase? I, think it's I you don't in think so. Oh, the hell I will! I will take back my daughter! <laughs> die, 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 die! So this is temporary? Oh, there it it does wear off. <laughs> it did last time. I understand your feelings, Mr. This is the end. I'm gonna shelter. If I combine Rose with a Megamycete, my daughter will be made manifest at last! I've waited a century. That's already screwed up! A century! Oh, now she's there. You won't eat me. Can I hit her while she's up there? Yes. Why do you eat her? Surely you have no need of hers now. So close to death. She's my goddamn daughter. You psycho. Oh. <laughs> Headshot. Nice. Okay, we know how to deal with spiders. Pipe bombs. Pipe bombs. I've never seen a human live without a spark. Are you sure you're not? If you're gonna lock yourself in an attack animation like that, I will 100% take advantage. Oh, I'm sorry, girl. You're looking a little ragged. You cool? Loading a grenade round. That was a finish. <laughs> you served me well, pistol. Weird set eyeball in the Resident Evil verse. The first game didn't have that until Lisa got put in. Um, so she was retconned. Wait, does the Metamucil not like direct sunlight, or is she just. Maybe it's because Miranda finally died. And she was forcing it to grow, now it's reverting. Rose! Rose looks up. Mr. Winters! <laughs> You're awfully big for a one-year-old. Her six month? Yeah. Uh, 
Why is he dying now? He took too much damage? I guess that's it. There's never a good explanation. That seems to sum up a lot of the stuff that goes on in RE8. There's never Ethan. a good explanation. Ethan! Come on, Ethan. Come on, Ethan, wake up. Take your green goo. Finished. Oh, finally. Finished. Recognition. Ethan. We gotta move. Is that her? Like a last ditch effort from her? Um, maybe, or things are just getting chaotic. Besides, remember what Chris tossed in that thing? Oh, yeah. Don't want to be there when it goes off. Why is it following them? Is it Rose? Keep moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. Ah, damn it. Mia's waiting for you. She's alive, you hear me? Alive. Oh, good. Here, Mia. take this thing to her. I'm so sorry. I love you. Keep Rose safe. Hey, hey. Hey. Yeah, you're not going to get clear of it dragging him along. Yeah. Can you tell yourself? Oh, come on, it's not that much further. Watch over her. Teach her to be strong. God damn it. Goodbye, Rosemary. Tell your sisters parsley sage in time. Ethan. That we'll go to the Scarborough Fair someday. <laughs> it is. It's like looking at him. Yeah. Though it doesn't have conventional eyes. Doesn't mean it can't still see. Or sense that he's there. Because he's like a unique case, isn't he? Seemingly rare, if not unique. And him and Mia both? I Mia might not be a mold person. Really? But we don't see her repairing herself that much after Rose. Dolby. I hope this is your baby. I just kind of found one in the village. Go. Go. Take us up uh, now. It's mine now. It it pisses me off. It looks Wait. like Mia gets away Where with everything. Good plan. Give the bomb trigger to the guy with no fingers. Get moving. We have to get clear. No. We can't go. Not without my husband. Mia, sit down and strap in. Not before you tell me where Ethan is. He's setting us up the bomb. Abandon us. Tell me what's going on. Where? It didn't look like on its oh, own God. that the Cadeau was a big threat. It was literally just hibernating down there. It probably just came up because people were fucking with it. Maybe? Maybe. What have you done? He's gone. I tried. He stayed so we could all escape. I'm sorry. If it was a boulder, I not could have done something. You need to see this. The condo's just like, that all you got? BSAA didn't send soldiers. This is a bioweapon. What the hell were they thinking? Wait, what? Orders, Captain. The BSAA the soldiers that dropped in were just like zombies? On the course were BSAA Europe HQ. Yeah. Or were they like mold infected? They almost look like tyrants, just smaller. So yeah. Someone's gotta pay. Now, I don't know if this has any significance, but people have looked at the models of them. They have Chris's skeleton. 
Is Chris a bioweapon? Or are they making bioweapons partly based on Chris? You are the perfect soldier. How do you think you managed to punch that fucking boulder? You didn't realize we were doing shit to you? Bro! But without any real context, it looks like... At least the European BSA is bad. Enjoy the Tim Burton movie. Yeah. Who oh, saw this at the beginning? There's more of it. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, okay. All right, all right. Come on. Is it like it's blood? Yes. To quench her thirst. For the record, blood is not a good source of uh, for hydration. There are more efficient ways. Which one was this? The doll maker? Yes. Or the dressmaker? The weaver. The weaver. that all of the lieutenants just happen to coincide with this local folktale. Yeah. I wonder if that's like... But remember, it's Miranda who bought this book for Rose. Oh, she may have made the book. That's possible. I was just wondering if, like, the family's bloodlines had been infected with Cadeau in the past, and that was the originator of the story. little thief I mean they did kind of set her up yes I think I said in the first stream this feels like something the Faye would fucking pull mm -hmm. these instances where they deal with somebody she snarled so more in turn is due in a blink the girl was trapped inside a mirror her parents though had searched all day and at last arrived with rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. It's fighting with just the torch, that's some bloodborne challenge save play. Our daughter, so mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. You just burned the entire woods down! The burnt forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. Hello, my yeah. Not the ending you were hoping for. I wonder what the Fae would do if they run across somebody who understands these stories and when they reach that point where, oh, clearly we set them up, now they take the... They're not taking it. Damn it. <laughs> Sitting there just waiting any day now. It's gonna happen. Any moment. And wait. I've got a millennia. Time is irrelevant to us. Alright, this was a wash. What? Oh, you you can't blame me for what I've done. I can and I will. I already have. Already have. Sorry, the screen goes dark if I don't do anything on the controller. Yes. So, this is meant to be similar to RE4's ending. Oh. We uh, no this part here with a slideshow hinting at what had used to happen, what had happened in the past, but I don't think this is as good as RE4 because RE4's little artistic slideshow let you know what happened to the children of the village. Oh, did they get eaten? 
They couldn't survive the infection. They just died. And they may have been eaten at that point. It definitely, well, I mean, for sure, the um, infected villagers in RE4 seem like they still have their wits about them. They're not just like feral monsters swinging axes. They're not feral, but they're, for most of them at least, their intellect is still severely reduced. I mean, they're still wearing clothes. Yes. From what I've heard, the remake, um, at least for the major ones, keeps more of their personality, but they start thinking strangely. Like, they see non-infected people as, like, food or threats. Well, for Mendez, he um, still feels dedicated to the village. He's following Sadler's orders and not taking care of the villagers, but he's still logging every single death in his notes. Is that the big centipede guy? Yes. Yeah. Rasputin. In... Ra ra Rasputin. <laughs> he's... Partly responsible for inviting the Los Illuminados back into the village. He believed that um, when they said that they had ways of helping this people treat with this strange sickness, he gave it a chance. He'd been spending a lot of his career, and this is of course only in the remake. He spent much of his career as the village elder trying to improve the place, bring education in, up, set up a factory. Um, fishing fish exports, etc. When he became infected, well, well, I already mentioned that part. Um, this looks way too big for the church in the village. Mother Miranda? I think so. And her experimenting on the villagers. The plague came to town. After the Spanish flu, she was the plague. But her treatments did improve the health of some people temporarily. So, do they put the whole, whole Cadeau in their body, or did this... Because I see an injectable, but you can't fit that in there. Right. So it's possible that you, they extracted something from the Cadeau buds mm -hmm. to inject into others? Yes. Um, like a weaker Cadeau? Also, don't forget that um, flies would come off... The, well, fly-like creatures would come off the Cadeau, and that became the girls. Really? But they became the... Yes. That the the flies seem to come off the Kudo parasites, and but they're only they're only similar to real world flies. Do you think that's how traditionally the Kudo would have spread pre hibernation? Possibly. Like, bugs would come in, they would eat the fungus, and then the fungus because it logs everything. Mm -hmm. Like, maybe a dead fly wound up on it, it ate the dead fly, decomposed, absorbed it, I don't know how it works. And it's like, oh, I can use these to spread. Or if it didn't know, it didn't have enough high consciousness to think that far ahead, it may just been like, oh, a new life form. And it just started imitating it, hmm. not knowing what it was doing. And then the epilogue. She's kept that book in really good shape. Do you think the little boy will be able to touch the moon? Not where they can touch the moon, it's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay, then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cool. That feels like a very young Velma. Uh, no, you can't do that. You need a rocket ship. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon can be Trying to explain to a parent the vacuum of space. <laughs> oh, 
Those should have been roses. I'm not saying she should have died. That's not what I meant. Hey, Dad. Happy birthday. They didn't have the time of death on the Sorry, I missed last week. Conveniently, no. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. Oh, she's been coming like every week. Ugh. Hey, get a new ride! Damn devil. <laughs> Duty calls. Oh, test, not like college. Yeah. I could have drove you here in this big ass yeah, SUV. Better. Where else? Wow. Day of all days. You are a dick. We have a situation. <laughs> You're needed, Evelyn. Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa. Whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. I will fucking end you. Stand down. What the fuck? Handle it. She's just a kid. Why does he seem like, oh, I'm gonna be just like Wesker? You're a lot like him, you know. They have the same engorged yeah. eyes he did. Is that intentional for her to look slightly less human? Probably. So, there is a figure you can see in the distance ahead. Yeah. There will be. Yeah. That's Ethan's model. Why? I don't know. Like, he's right there with you, Rose. This is... Are they pulling over to pick him up? Like, holy shit, Ethan's alive. Well, the DLC confirms he's not, but he's a voice in Rose's head. It's a bit like uh, Bioshock Infinite in that regard, but um, worse. As in, not as good. We don't have to play the DLC. Okay. You you really do not sound psyched about it. Not in and the if slightest. It's, if, it's, if it's not well written, then we... No, I don't know. All right, I got, um... Great Dad. Least casual. Bro, this was not normal! Don't you catch... Yeah, you better give me the normal one. Yeah, thank you. That's what I fucking thought. A standard whatever. That sounds better than normal. Did get anything else? Any? No? Okay. Oh, he has to add to the bonus. Man. Extra content shop. Concept art. Figures. Challenges. Complete challenges. Listen to the challenges menu in order to receive completion points. Completion points can be exchanged for a variety of bonuses in the extra content shop. New game mode. Weapons. Concept art. Figures. All the movies have been added to the movies. Village of Shadows full version. Creating the Village of Shadows level design. Okay, it's behind the same shit. I don't care. Following weapon from the extra content shop for finishing the main story of Wilcox. Not liking this. <laughs> the following challenges can be used to purchase items. So I completed these? You did. Mystery. These are just achievements. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Now, you can okay. buy unlockables if you want. I want to check them out! I know we're about done, and we, we're about to wrap up tonight's stream. I want to check this shit out. This one, right? The yes. extra country. Ooh, wait. Figures? Do I have to buy them? You do. The mercenaries. Oh, that's the Dragoon rifle? No, it's using? not. The Dragoon's further down. Chris's favorite blade. No. Now oh, there it is. The Usmai. Dragoon. Hand cannon puzz. Hardcore difficulty? You did that, didn't you? Maybe. Did you? 
I'm trying to think if I did, if I just did hard. The rocket pistol? Village of Shadows difficulty? I really like that if you fully upgrade a gun and get it infinite ammo, this still counts. You can beat hardcore difficulty with infinite ammo grenade launcher. Yes. And it'll count toward the bonus. Mm -hmm. What the fuck? You get a lightsaber. Like the LZ answerer. Not including the bloody stages from addition. What the fuck? Is, th is it like a knife? It is a melee weapon, yes. Lemmy! Fully customized. Shit, you need all the upgrades to it. But yes. you can buy those. You can buy those. Weapon. Yet we're missing a clip extension, which looks like a drum clip, maybe. Infinite ammo. Okay, it's just... Okay, it's infinite ammo for the... Ah, oh, no! So close. So the good news is, if you get the points, you can just come in here, purchase it, save the game, and... Well, auto save the game, and it'll be in play. How do you? Oh, you do challenges to get the yes. Point. Stick Magnum. I never got that. It's unlockable. Oh. <laughs> no head. Rosemary. Now, 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 no. So she was the hag the whole time. Yes. Why? Why was she trying to help you along? Why was she trying to help you kill the others? Well, it was implied by Heisenberg that she wanted to test Ethan somehow, have him wipe out her four children, and then, oh, he'll take over. But then she doesn't do that at the end. This one was a lichen. These are called lichen large. Ah, oh, that's tempting. I can get the ladies. Yeah. Oh, she even gave them her last name. Yes. Mutated. Samka, not Samraka. Baby. To baby. Moro A, Moro B, Mutated Moro. Carl Heisenberg. Aller. Aller. So that in these. I'm just looking at the pictures, I'm not going to read all of these. Megamycete, Arias, Strawfer, Flying Form, Spider Form, Miranda Berserk. Also, that final flower thing was Miranda. Yes. Just, like, her one last... Okay, huzzah. You can get figures of the guns. Yes. You can just examine them when you pick them up, right? Yes. So... This is just something to unlock. Concepty art. Scrolling, scrolling. Scrolling. Keep this thing a scrolling. And then did you want to test out the mercenaries? Eh. Okay. I mean, just... Oh, 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 oh. You can play as Lady D. I know. I've heard... Foolish man thing. Uh, man, that's a lot of shit. Yeah. The designs, and it's that fucking tractor. Huh. Oh. Okay, these are. Oh, I didn't know that they had a fluttering cloak effect. That's rather cool. Would you have a favorite? The Daniela? Sandra? Bella? Cassandra. I'm kind of with you on that one. She also has a bit more personality. Ah, uh, it won't. Ah, uh, okay. They are wearing fishnets, though, I can tell you that. I'm a bad person. <laughs> Yay! Oh! Oh, she's packing. She was the first one he fought near the kitchen. He's having fun. A 
thought that was moving for a second. <laughs> I thought I saw like a slight movement. That is some booty. Yeah, I'm being weird. I'm impressed by the flowers. Good day, sir. <laughs> Hello. Good day, sir. But yes, before you kill any... Well, before you kill more than one of her daughters, um, if you shoot her in the head, she'll stop for a second, adjust her hat, then proceed to chase you down. So it's probably highly likely the clothing is also created. Maybe. I, th I would think hers is because they said she had the most control. Well, we do see a duplicate of that dress in her room. Yeah, she had to model the, her own dress after something. Okay. Alright, that, that'll be it. We're good. Well, <laughs> now we need to think about next time, I guess. I'm kind of voting toward Dead Space 2. There's also Birth of Fire 3. Yes. If anyone in chat can come up with some more suggestions, let us know. We may put a poll up. Yes. Let y'all throw some 20s at it. All right. Who you want to raid? Well, let's see who's live. If I can, I remember I can do this from here. All right.